To solve this question, let's first start by taking the difference between each pair of numbers. The difference between 2 and 6 is going to be plus 4. Then 6 and 3 will be minus 3. 3 and 9 will be plus 6. And 9 and 6 will be minus 3. So I'm noticing two different alternating patterns here. We've got subtract 3 on every other um, on every other difference between each pair of numbers. So that would be consistent, but that's not going to help us find our missing number, right? Because negative three, that pattern wouldn't kick in until the next number after that. So what's going on with these numbers here? It looks like it's an addition problem, excuse me, an arithmetic pattern that's going up by two each time. But if I were to try that here, plus eight, 16 plus eight gives me 14, and that is not one of my answer choices. So I'm going to back up and see if maybe there's a geometric pattern going on here. 2 plus 4 to get 6. What about 2 times 3? And then 6 minus 3. 3 plus 6 to get 9, or 3 times 3 to get 9. That is true. And then minus 3. So now we've uncovered the real pattern, which is an alternating geometric and arithmetic pattern. Um, so now what we need to do is multiply 6 by 3 to get the next number in our series, and 6 times 3 would give us 18, making answer choice C our correct answer.